morning friends hope you guys are well hope you guys are doing really well today welcome to another vlog <laughs> so i've grabbed myself a cup of smoothie this morning because <laughs> i'm staying away from coffee not because i can't have any coffee while i'm pregnant but i just decided to just stay away from you know coffee and some other things like too much salt <laughs> while i'm pregnant but i usually light um, one of my coffee scented candles in the mornings to just you know give me that <laughs> that sense that i'm drinking coffee <laughs> and then i've replaced uh, my coffee with more water and then juices juices like this fresh um, fruit juice or smoothies so when um, in my first trimester I don't know you guys must have seen my experience video and you know that it was a, it was really tough like <laughs> it was a really tough experience I couldn't keep anything down throwing up everything that I eat so at least I could I had to put something you know in my belly and before I throw it up, at least the nutrients would have, you know, entered into my bloodstream. <laughs> so this um, juice from this particular brand was the um, smoothie and the juice my husband was getting for me at the time. And that was the only thing I could enjoy, cold. So I would drink it and at least it would still stay in my belly for a while before I threw it up. And uh, this, uh, uh, this company, they are close to my husband's office. So it was easy for him to just stop by, you know, and get a few bottles for me and that's the only thing I was like really enjoying every other thing was horrible in my mouth but this juice <laughs> this smoothie was the only thing I enjoyed at the time even though I was still through it up so I'm used to it so I try to take you know it's fresh fruit juice no sugar no additives so it's good for you so I, I love I love taking this in the mornings or a cup of water you know, just to make sure I'm getting enough hydration and getting enough nutrients in my body for our baby. <laughs> okay, so the plan for today is I'm having my um, maternity photo shoot today, which is really exciting. <laughs> I've been looking forward to it, planning it for a while now. And my cousin is a fantastic maternity and baby photographer. So she's going to be coming over, excuse me, <laughs> she's going to be coming over and working her magic on us. So that is planned for today. And I also want to um, get the baby's bassinet up to couple the baby's bassinet. And thankfully it's um, public holiday tomorrow. So today is Sunday. So tomorrow, Monday, is public holiday, so my husband will be home, so we'll be able to do that together. Then I also want to um, couple up the um, trolley that I plan to do, because I plan to do like a mobile feeding slash <laughs> diaper station, and that will be close to the bed, but it's also mobile, that you can move around the house. So I got a trolley for that, so I'll um, get that up and running. I also stopped yesterday, we stopped by Miniso and I got some organizers that I want to use for the trolley as well. I'll show you, I'll show you guys that um, later. And another exciting thing, my breast pump arrived <laughs> yesterday as well. So I'm so happy because if there was one thing that has given me a little anxiety all through this pregnancy, I've tried my possible best to just you know be in a state of calm and bliss because I know myself I can get stressed and worked up over nothing so I've tried you know to just be calm and just you know enjoy the process and not overthink you know too much but there's one thing that has given me anxiety and that is breastfeeding and <laughs> I've heard lots of horrible you know stories of you know people's breasts hurting them you know and having you know clogged you know milk ducts where the milk is not coming out and your baby can't feed well so it has been you know it has been giving me a little bit of stress so i did more research and instead of just wallowing in the stress i just decided to research about it and get more information and be educated 
you know, on the topic. So I found this a particular brand on Instagram that just gave me what I wanted, the peace of mind, the assurance. So she makes um, breast pumps, but beyond that, she gives information. If you are having challenges breastfeeding, if you don't know what to do, first time mom, you don't know where to start. She has all that information on her page that she updates daily. You know, so most of my fears, most of the worries that I had were just settled when I found her page. So I just decided, you know what, this is the woman I'm going to get my breast pump from. <laughs> so the breast pump came um, yesterday. So I'm really excited about that. I'll show you guys maybe at the end of this vlog. So that is the plan for today. So I want to get ready for the uh, maternity shoot. My cousin has given me the time that she's coming. So I have a little bit of time to do my makeup. I actually planned on having someone come to do my makeup and my hair. But as you know, we have to save that money. <laughs> so I decided to save that money <laughs> and do my makeup myself, do my hair myself. So I already started on that one on the hair part so just to do you know the makeup and get ready so that is the plan for today and i look forward to spending the day <laughs> and these days with you guys
hi guys so it's actually a couple of days later <laughs> i haven't been able to pick up the camera to film anything in a couple of days so um that day we had the photo shoots the maternity photo shoot and it was just amazing my cousin ufa is extremely talented <laughs> she knows her work <laughs> and she knows she just knows how to you know calm the whole room make the room fun you know we played our music and my husband even had fun <laughs> doing feminine stuff <laughs> so it was really nice my dress i got from a, a maternity um kind of like a maternity designer <laughs> called um tender plum i think i'll make i'll make sure i get the name right and put the name on the screen so they actually made the dress for me so they they take your measurements and they or you send them your measurements and then they sew they have some designs you know that they work with for maternity photo shoots and then they sew um the dress for you so it was really lovely that one was really nice so the whole experience was really really nice <laughs> and i appreciate my cousin for her time coming all the way to our home to take the pictures and we took some lovely pictures i'm really happy it was really difficult to select the one the ones that she will edit because <laughs> we took a lot of lovely pictures in fact all the pictures she selected um for us to choose from were well, all good i didn't know which one to choose from but i just had to choose <laughs> so that was nice sorry if you can hear like fan going on in the background i have to even put off my second fan <laughs> so that you won't hear um, background noise i'll try and deal with that when i'm editing then the following day we were able to set up the um the baby's bassinet i also set up the trolley um that the next day as well so that one is good to go so it's just left for me to fill the trolley up with the baby's um diapers and the baby's um, bathing and feeding supplies then um on saturday so like i said it's a couple of days later <laughs> so this is a brand new week so on saturday we were able to go to the um other shop the other baby shop i wanted to go to Oh, oh my god so lovely that one is in uh, idumota although it was being pregnant and walking on the streets of that balogun idumota market that mandela's area is not fun but i just had to do it so we found the shop and oh my god they have the most amazing baby things like if you are looking for quality baby things then that store i recommend that store so i was able to get uh, most of the other things that i need the hospital list items and the other baby things that i need personally then i we stopped by some other so they have like a baby section in that market you know that market has lots of sections <laughs> so we stopped by the baby section another shop in the baby section so i was able to get the smaller you know smaller bits and pieces that i needed so i think we are good for now with baby things other things will we'll probably get other things as um, when the baby comes but for now we are good to go with that so let me just show you guys the breast pump that i chose like i said i'm very excited about my breast pump because the breasts <laughs> and breastfeeding um side of this whole motherhood and pregnancy thing was something that was giving me a little bit of anxiety and like i said when i discovered this particular brand i was just happy because she answered on her page she answers questions she puts out information about breastfeeding about you know using your pump how to get milk out from your body you know just how to be able to breastfeed your baby with ease you know so when i found her page out of the other pages i'm sure there are other people but she was the one that just gave me rest of mind that was why i decided to go with her breast pump and so i i just asked her what do i need as a new mom <laughs> what do i need basic, the basic items that i need you know as a new mom and she gave me a list so we were able to go through the list and um, that was what i picked i think there's just one item left on the list that i haven't picked and that's the sterilizer so i'm going to get that one that one is a little bit um pricier but i'm already saving towards it to get that one before the baby comes so first off on the breast pump 
on <laughs> is the is the breast pump itself I don't know if you guys can see it I'll probably put up I'll probably put up a kind of overview shot of what the entire set looks like so like I said this is the beginner this is the first mom set <laughs> uh, or a new mom set sorry so this is the um, breast pump so the name of the brand is called Best Moms. You can find them on Instagram. So the breast pump um, package looks like this. And in this package, we have, in this package, we have the, so it's an electric breast pump and it's a double, let me see. So let me just read it. So it's the double electric breast pump. And in this particular package, you have the double, um, you have the double bottles. So this is where you would, this is what you will connect to your breasts. <laughs> so you connect this to your, um, to, to your breasts and to the um, breast pump controller. And this is where the milk will be extracted into. So they are basically feeding bottles. So you can also use them to feed your baby as well. Once you are done, um, once you are done pumping your milk into them. So we have two of that. And then we have the breast pump, breast pump <laughs> controller itself. And this is what it looks like. So I like that it's very small, very cute, like it's not big. <laughs> so it's, you know, it's really nice. It's mobile and then it has a massage function. So I think that is the function you use first that will massage your breasts, you know, for optimum pumping and then the sucking um, button. I think this is the one that actually sucks out the breast milk. And then you have the controllers, so the plus or the minus, if you want it faster, you want it slower. So this is what the controller looks like. Again, very small and very portable. In the new mom sets, you also have the breast milk storage and feeding bottles. So you have four bottles. So you have four feeding bottles. So after you pump your after you pump your the milk into the um, bottles those other bottles i showed you can transfer them into these bottles if you are not ready to feed your baby immediately and keep this in the fridge so it comes with the teeth comes with the teeth comes with the teeth like this where the baby sucks from and this what this is what the bottle looks like it's um, BPA free and then it also has the cover like this so if you are not ready to feed your baby instead of you um, instead of covering the bottle with the teat you cover the bottle with this and then you keep at the back of your fridge so all the information about I'm not a salesperson this video is not sponsored this is just <laughs> I haven't used it yet obviously but this is just what you know I got for myself so all the information about this breast pump and all other information you can get it from the horse's mouth <laughs> from the person that um, created the product so i'll leave her instagram page linked in the description but for now i just have this um, four bottles in this in this package and then the two extra bottles where you pump the milk into and then next we have the breast milk storage bags and the compre sterilized breast milk storage bags okay so this one is obviously to store your milk in the freezer when you're not ready to feed your baby so this is good for moms that have to go to work and you are going to leave your baby with maybe your mother-in-law or your mom or you know someone at home so the person can just easily bring out your stored um, um, your stored milk from the freezer leave it out to to thaw and then warm it and then give your baby so this is good so this particular 
um, package comes with 30 bags so you can buy more when you need it then what I also like about the bag is that it comes with a thermal um, sensor so underneath the bag here so underneath the bag here you can see two smiley faces one is blue and one is pink so when the when the sensor when the blue one is when you are warming the milk from the bag when the blue one is showing it means the milk is not warm enough but when the pink cute face starts to show means your milk is warm enough for your baby so i also like that then and then it comes pre-sterilized i don't know if i've mentioned it and then of course it's bpa free and then in the new mom kit you also need your breast pads you also need your breast pads so that your milk the milk coming out from your breast doesn't stain your outfits so this package comes with i think 24 yeah 24 pads so this should go a long way depending on how often you go out and then the last thing in the set or in the kit the new mom kit is the pumping bra so this one came highly recommended by the um, woman that owns the breast pump because with this one it's very easy for you to pump hands free because this connector here this valve or what, whatever it's called connects into the breath into the pumping bra so you wear the bra and then this connects this attaches into the bra you know connecting your your breasts your nipples and then the um, pumping bra holds this in place and then you can pump without holding imagine having to pump for 30 minutes and then yeah holding your holding the breast pump like this <laughs> You know it's not really convenient so but with the pumping bra this one holds the two of them or one if you are pumping with one breast holds it in place and then you can use your hands for um, other things so this one came highly recommended okay so this is what it looks like i got the black i think this is the large the large size so i think that is it for the best mom <laughs> breast pump new mom starter kits so that is it for the breast pump <laughs> the breast pump haul so like i said i will leave the ladies information in the description below and if you follow me on instagram i'll also post my progress <laughs> as i use the products and leave a review of um of how it is how it is how easy or how difficult it is to work with but hopefully it will be easy because I've seen lots of great reviews from other moms who use the product and have testified that they are really happy with it. So I can't wait to use them. So I'll be carrying the um, breast pump and some bottles with me to the hospital for delivery because I want to start using it as soon as the baby comes. So I think what I have, what I have to do now is to sterilize some of the parts. So she, she's, she has also added a very detailed instruction on how to use her products so she has listed all the things that you need to sterilize that will come in contact with your breast milk before you start using the product so that is what i have to do before i before i pack it with me so it's currently monday so this week i plan on just getting myself ready <laughs> for this baby i've started packing my hospital bag but i'm going to film all that in my next vlog hopefully i'll show how i pack my hospital bag and um the set up the trolley like i mentioned and then i also want to set up a changing um, station in our room so i plan to use this cabinet behind me here you can even see the changing pad <laughs> so i want to set that up this week just get you know myself prepared i want my hospital bag ready <laughs> on the go <laughs> for when we have to grab it to go to the hospital so that is my plan for this week and then i have a few other bits of content to film for instagram as well so you guys just keep um, posted on my page <laughs> if you're not following me already follow me over on instagram i'll leave my handle linked in the description 
and then if you haven't subscribed to this channel already kindly subscribe and like this video and also hit the notification bell so you can get notified every time i post a new video okay guys that is it for today's video hope you are well hope you guys are staying safe take care of yourselves and i'll see you in my next video bye guys Thank you.